And then the last one, rule six is, is almost all encompassing because it actually touches the other five. That's why we saved it for last. So it's not really a sixth of the equation. It's really like 80% of the equation, but it touches it, it interweaves with the other five. And that rule six, the world says it really, it matters who you work for. You know, what's the number one reason that people leave jobs? Well, they don't like their manager, right? So it really matters who you work for. The renegade goes, fine, I'll work for myself, right? That's an easy solution. I can solve that. At least I can control that guy. I might not even like him, but at least I can control him. Uh, so I'm going to work for myself. And the, the people shift says, we work together. It's not, I work for you, you work for me. It's, we work together. And so it starts with engineering the culture that, that we believe we want to have now and as we grow up. So it can be a little aspirational. We're, we're going to grow into this culture. And um, it's the place that we believe is going to help people thrive and become the best versions of themselves. And then we talk about the, the problems are no longer yours to solve as the as the renegade leader, you've got other people that are actually better suited to solve some of the problems that you used to have to solve. And then the people aren't yours to lead. We kind of already talked about that. That's our aggressive way of saying that your primary job as a leader is to lead yourself well. And it's about who you show up as and how you can show up for others in any role of, of influence or leadership. So all of those shifts work together and there's a underlying thread. I mentioned it a few times of dignity which within each of these. So bet with intention, we're giving the, the dignity of giving everybody the clarity of what we're trying to do in the organization and how we're going to do it. Set the baseline, the dignity of consistency, know when you're winning the dignity of success. Start with the end in mind, the dignity of why this matters. We got to do we, the dignity of identity. We work together, the dignity of humanity. And remembering that all of this, you know, the, the reason that my heart beats so hard for entrepreneurs is one, I've been there and I've been in their shoes. But the bigger, the bigger drive is the ripples that these renegades make in their communities and the lives of the people that they get to interact with. I don't think there's a better place to work than small business America. And that I don't think there's a better place than small business America to actually grow the people in our community to impact their families, the philanthropy that happens out, out of that community impact. So I, the, the ripples that, have the potential to take place from people getting unstuck as a renegade founder and moving to a renegade leader are infinite.